nature provides and humans consume. It is an everlasting process which started millions of years ago. Nature provided us this beautiful landscape, clean water, pure air, a bright sun, and immense resources of energy and raw materials to improve our life discomfort. As long as there is a balance between provision and consumption, our children can continue the lifestyle we teach them. During the last decade, however, the number of consumers increased anxiously and nature suffers. The World Heritage starts with the preservation and the protection of our natural heritage. Unfortunately, the citizens on our globe produce billions of tons of harmful waste. We are contaminating and destroying our environment. Nobody can predict exactly what will be the consequences of the climate changes caused by global pollution. It is without any doubt that our behavior will have a big impact on our planet. We cannot afford continuously to pollute and contaminate. Humans are a part of nature, so we have to preserve our nature for future generations. This is our small but very important contribution to a clean global environment. We are so proud to present you a unique waste treatment system, the plasma classification and smelting unit called PGSU. PGSU is a modular system consisting of the treatment and feeding model, the plasma reactor, the gas cleaning model, and the cogeneration model. PGSU is a closed system and every model has its own, has its own function in the whole process. The principle is based on gasification of the waste in the plasma reactor inside of the plasma arc zone. We can treat various kinds of waste and get harmless recycled raw materials and available energy. PGSU is able to treat water silt, plastic waste, electronic scrap, catalytic converter, hospital waste, as well as communal waste and many other types bent on the specific demands of our clients. The first model, pretreatment and feeding model, is appropriately constructed for the waste we have to treat. The existing waste is sorted, shredded, dried, and prepared into the form suitable for the feeding system of the plasma reactor. The principle of plasma reactor is a cathode, graphite electrode, and an anode which is created by the body of plasma reactor. Nitrogen is used as a plasma forming gas for the plasma arcson. The smelting and gasification process is based on an electric high power DC transferred plasma arc reactor with single graphite electrode operating under neutral or reducing atmosphere. In the process of gasification, there is a high temperature of about 30,000 degrees Celsius inside the plasma zone, which enables us to transform a harmful waste into not harmful products. In the extremely high thermal plasma temperature, the waste flux is melted and converted into metal alloys composed of various not volatile metals and inner slag, consisting of not combustible inner materials like glass and ceramics. The organic and plastic components are converted into high energetic flammable synthesis gas called Syngas. This is one of the most important products of the plasma classification process. The high energetic Syngas is flowing from the plasma reactor to the third model, the gas cleaning model, where evaporated volatile metals are separated. After cleaning, we obtain clean Syngas that is already suitable for using in the cogeneration unit and recycled dust metal concentrate like copper, zinc, cadmium, lead, and so on in the form of metal powder, which is possible to use in the metal industry. non leachable inner slag consisting of glass, ceramics, and other harmless contents can be used in the civil engineering and construction materials. The main products of the smelting process are all non-combustible, inert material and non volatile metals that are melted and transformed into inner slag and metal alloys. 
The content of the inner slug and metal alloys depend on the type of the waste treated, but in general, there are recycled metals like copper, iron, aluminium, zinc, and so on. PGSU can be successfully used in the metal industry where particular kinds of waste like electronic scrap, catalytic converter, can be transformed into basic metals like copper, iron, tin, nickel and so on, but also into other precise metal like gold, silver and platinum. In order to obtain better yieldingness of melted metals, we put particular additives to the process. The clean high energetic syngas with high content of hydrogen and carbon monoxide, which is similar to the natural gas, is used as fuel for the cogeneration unit where electric power and thermal energy are produced. A part of electric energy is recuperated and used in the plasma reactor. Depending on the waste composition, the system can be self-supplied with electric power and heat energy. Excess of both energy can be used for other purposes or can be sold. The waste treatment process of PGSU is commercially feasible and environmentally friendly. The recuperation of material and energy is huge. There is not any solid or liquid waste left. PGSU is a closed modular system. Every model is put into a separate shipping container. It improves flexibility, mobility and transport. All technological process is computer monitored and controlled and the process is safe and noiseless. The products of the waste treatment unit PGSU have the following beneficial output. High energetic syngas which is used in cogeneration unit for generation of electric and heat energy. Metal dust and metal alloy which are suitable for recycled metals production. Precipitated salts which can be used in chemical industry. Inner slug can be used in civil engineering and building materials. We are sure that everyone is convinced of the necessity to recycle waste and other materials. We believe that this small presentation contributes to a better understanding of our plasma reactor. Many years and huge amounts are invested in order to find a workable solution for one of the main contamination problems. Our plasma reactor will be the answer and solution by excellency. In order to preserve our children from future disaster, in order to grant them the opportunities we got from our ancestors, in order to continue our civilization, we have to correct our lifestyle immediately and preserve our environment. Let's join our knowledge and responsibilities to tackle this problem with our plasma reactor. We want to show the young generation that we are responsible parents. We want our children to remember us as protectors and guards of the beautiful nature they live in. We want to show the future generation that respect for Mother Earth and nature equals respect to each other. Thank you for your attention.